Happy New Year, everybody, everybody of your friends, your family, your loved ones, everybody, dogs, cats, fish, hamsters, J crispy, everybody, everybody, Happy New Year. Uh, first off, thank you for, I'd say, a, a pretty good year. There are some ups and downs, but uh, 2022, for the most part, I think was a very solid, very solid year. 2023. It's begun, but you know what? None of that even matters, okay? Because I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you in in a little, little secret, a little secret. All right, 2023 is gonna be different, only because we're gonna be doing something crazy. So this right here is my VHS collection. I have more. I have obviously the ones on top. I have some behind my couch. I have some in my bedroom, which are music tapes and all that fun stuff. Um, and some, of course, just kind of like hidden around the room, uh, and, you know, my pride and joy, but we're going to be focusing on this shelf that I'm, you know, uh, showing off right now. So I own, uh, roughly 525 VHS tapes on this shelf, not including my clamshells and not including the sealed. I've only seen about half of them. And so... This year, in 2023, we are going to be watching um, all the ones I haven't watched. And if this sounds very familiar, this was my 100th video, uh, was watching 100 movies that I've never seen before. And those 100 movies completed my VHS collection at the time. But now, obviously being almost two years later, um, I've accumulated many more tapes and... Frankly, that's a bit much to do in one video, and I'm not very proud of that video anyways. So, what we're doing is a little bit different. So, we're going to be watching three movies a week. And, you know, it could be any day, it doesn't really matter. As long as we watch, uh, what is that, 3, 6, 9, 12, 12 movies a month. Those 12 movies will be new ones that we've never seen before. And so, we'll be going down, going down the shelf, alphabetical. It's going to be real nice. So, uh, for example, I've never seen 1941. But I've seen 2001, I've seen 2010, I've seen About Schmidt. I haven't seen Abad and Costello meets Frankenstein. What is this? What, what, why am I telling you this? Well, at the end of every month, I'm going to be doing a review video. Which, it's going to be real short. 12 movies. It'll probably be a 5 minute video. But something that I wish I did in the, the 100 movie review is, you know, I didn't really go in detail in them. I, it wasn't really a fun video to watch, Frank, in my opinion. Um, so with doing this once a month, I'm going to be able to put more information in a video. Uh, it's something to look forward to, and it'll keep me motivated to obviously, you know, watch all these plastic squares. Uh, at the end of the month, or the beginning of the next month, expect a video of me talking about 12 new movies that I have seen. Now, obviously, there's a couple rules. I'll, I'll write any that I forget to say in the description, but the main one is if I come across a sequel, which the biggest example is Pink Panther. Uh, where is it? Oh, right here. I've never seen any of the Pink Panthers, so when I, when I, get a, when I finally get to the point of watching Pink Panther, I would watch the sequels beforehand and then watch the two Pink Panther movies. Um, so basically, if there's a sequel, I'm going to watch the one, the the, the movie before it, uh, if that makes sense. That's mainly, that's the main rule that I want to keep up with, just because I don't just want to, I don't want to watch the movie just to watch it. I, I want to, you know, understand the lore. You know what I'm saying? I'll be doing TikTok updates on what I'll be watching, but uh, for the most part, the reviews are going to be kept at the end of the month just to make it all nice and sweet. But yeah, uh, I hope everyone will enjoy my new little series that I'm doing this year. And here are those movies that I'm talking about. There's 168, and obviously I'll still be making my usual content in between, but at the end of every month, expect a little review video. Maybe next year I'll do my DVD collection, because that's also very large, and maybe the next next year I'll do my Laserdisc collection and CEDs. That's that's in the future, though. Right now, we're focusing on this. All right. Happy New Year, everybody. Uh, thank you all for everything. It's been a, a wonderful year, and let's let's hope this next year is 
even more beautiful. No moop, only sassy nom noms. You know what I'm saying? All right. Adios.